Right, here we are. The fabulous Southfield. And from the video, you probably realise I'm not wearing an only draw. And I've drawn down other end, which is first time this year. And this is Peg 68, look, I'll show you. 68, which is next to the MPEG. Never drawn that MPEG, but I've been on next to MPEG two or three times. And last time I got battered. <laughs> um, it's really windy as it normally is. Um, I'm not sure how. It's a southerly, but it's still chilly, it's still not red hot. And it's a shame really because if it were warmer, I'd fancy this light mad. Um, but we're going cold, I don't know whether they'll be here. There's been a few fish down here, so we'll see. But these pegs, when they're here, you can't beat them. And from now on, these will be good pegs for a month or so, and then they'll all go hot fish. They'll all go back into the canal, I think, so we'll see. Um, but that's where I've normally been drawn. Up there, look. You can see up there, I wouldn't that with them vans out our front of that last week so anyway we're not so so I've got a lot of room we've all got a spare peg on a Wednesday so let's have a look at Ben first there he is look and uh, what, what's he got today he's got some ham some tongue some biscuits and some cheese it's not even eating his cheese today so it's unbelievable I can't believe it. normally demolish his cheese because he must be cross with a mouse that's a big mouse um, there you go and we parked just there and walked through here. So what am I doing? Well basically, I think if you've been watching my blogs you can, you'll know what I've been what I've been up to. Um, there you go, my ground bait, there you go you see. And uh, everything's down here. New playing about with a new backrest because our new all our new stuff's coming now into the shops like he's I've had that for a while but they've just come in shops now so I've got a new backrest as you can see but I've actually got a fitting that fits it now look fits it lovely looks look nice and smug though right chuff with that to be honest with you usual things maggots pinkies worms and everything same routine say I've even put a keep net in today which will surprise most people and thank you to everybody that's given me a load, load of abuse and stick about last weekend because I deserved it. I really did. But anyway, we're not going to do that today, hopefully. So yeah, so it's pretty straightforward. I'm going to fish. It's a bit different down here. I don't know whether it's... The fish seem to feed a bit different at this end than they do others. I don't know why. And um, tend to be a bit smaller fish generally. Um, saying that hopefully I'll get some big ones. Um, but I'm just going to fish 48 metres and and 30 metres, which I've been doing a few weeks. But the fish, you can catch the fish closer here for some reason. I don't know why. It's one of the areas where you don't get actually... the first, you don't get any rewards normally for going further um, for some reason, I don't know why, but it's just the way it is I don't know and I'm going to put a short light in, and last week all fish were short but it's gone cold again so I'm going to put it just to cover it last hour, last week it was stupid and uh, it would have, so you've got to put it in I'm not sure up there, because when you're coming this way you don't see many people so there it is, look, so straightforward, two rods 11 and 12 foot all rounder, marvellous all rounds with 4,000 5,000 reels and, uh, and my sublime braid and simple as that really and just that's it beautiful though here yeah. where else do you want to be sat here bit of wind that's clubhouse nobody in it looks like there's nobody in it. what a shame but it's what it is beautiful isn't it look at that I'll let you know how we get on oh I'm glad that's of it it's uh, unbelievable. I've had 10 bream skimmers for £15.8 and uh, I hope next week it's windy and wet. We can make a change from the beach sunshine and flat calm. God, it's unbelievable. I just like everywhere now. I'm, I'm not, I shouldn't be grumbling because I know people are working in offices and factories and so I think I might have won my little five pegs, but I won't do hat trick. I won't last two Wednesdays, and I were hoping for hat trick. But uh, uh, but the strange thing is, I've caught 
first second chuck had a bite, missed it, lost a little fish coming in, fishing at 48, and then I've um, not had no for an hour, then I've got four skimmers like a pounders in four chucks, couldn't get a bite, an hour later, gone on my 30 meter line, got a pounder first chuck, and then a bit later on, I've couldn't catch out, gone long, first chuck I've had one two pounds, second chuck one four pound, then could get a bite, come back on my short line, on my 30 metre line, and I've had, I think, four, four, five, I've had three, like two pounders, and I've had indication and a liner all day, and, I've, and at about seven minutes to go, my rod's gone down, a big line, and I've picked up on it thinking it would buy, chuck straight back out, so it's gone straight back, not the Chuck back out and had another big liner. In the last three casts I've had three big liners and not caught a fish. It's almost like they've come in. Unbelievable. But I don't know, I've had a few there and a few up there just watching them weigh in. And they they've hardly caught out there, what I can see. So I think I've won my little five pegs, but I'm not going to do treble, which is a bit disappointing. And I could only get a bite today on a... Um, on the worm today. That's all I couldn't catch on out else. I just couldn't catch on anything else. Mick's got a few there. I don't think he's got 15 pounds though. So I'll let you know anyway. But to God, honestly, just love, would just love a warmer day. Because I, I tell you something, if it's been warm here today, I won't match. Because uh, there's still a few fish down this end. So oh, we'll see. I'll let you know. Just got back and. Uh, 15 eight, I'm, ooh, I'm annoyed now, 21 pounds won't match. I reckon I could have caught that. Uh, I know it's easy after, six pounds, two, two, uh, two or three bites. Um, I felt there was some fish in my peg last little bit, so uh, I won my section. I think I finished fifth, it might, it might be sad, I don't know, but I felt, oh, like 21 pounds a big weight on that lake, and uh, like I say, I've had 15 pounds. Perhaps I should have fished me a longer line a bit longer. Um, twice I was going to pick up and pick up and go on my long line and I caught a fish on my 30 metres. Perhaps did it a bit too long on my 30 metres, but anyway. Um, so I've won my section, I can't grumble. Only thing I've done different today, I've been catching on maggots on hook, to be honest with you. And I, 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 I couldn't catch today. When I put maggots on, I got bitter dart, so I had to fish worms today. So I've, I've just put a bit more worm in the, than I would have done normal. Apart from that, everything were, were basically the same. Um, just I, I put more worm in and I fished with worms on oak. But down our end, there weren't many weights. So, you know, I were, I think I were pegged 68 and uh, there's been nobody in that bottom couple of sections. You know, I, I duck, had a big weight, so... So I've done all right from where, I, where I've come, but I feel like I've, at the end, especially with having them two liners and missed a bite, um, I should have caught an, another fish or two, and £18 were third, I st certainly should have been third. But I've had £15 from, from you know, probably down at the bottom end, so I can't grumble. I've had a few bites, 10 fish, and missed a couple, so I can't really grumble, but I'm just fed up with wind, and I'm fed up with getting wet, it's unbelievable. I mean, look at big lad here. He's, he's out for count. He's he's wrecked. He is. Look at him. He's so, he's snoring away already. He is. Um. So so I think he's uh, we've worn him out. So yeah. So uh, I could have done, maybe I could have done that trick, but I didn't anyway. So that's how it goes. But I'm not grumbling. I've had a few bites. I can't really grumble. So we'll see. So we'll see what happens. All the best. So we'll, we'll just bread and dripping again, and we'll get on with it.